Welcome to DC20011. Um, this evening, when this, these listings come to an end, they will be in the Asian category, antiques, and with each uh, respective category, tea, wine pots, ginger jars, vases, figures, all closet A, all really good quality, feels like really good quality closet A. And let's not even mention just visually pleasant and beautiful. I will be posting at the bottom of the video caption uh, the time frame when the introduction comes to an end where we will pick up on each piece separately as I list them. We have here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight claws and eight pieces. And we will provide a video for each one because they all deserve it. They all deserve the time that we're going to invest into them to make sure that they are appreciated by the viewer as much as we appreciate them. OMG. OMG. It has the silhouette of a teapot. Very, very, very Japanese. Very, very, very mid 19th century, 1850, maybe 1840. In its texture and construction, you're gonna be able to identify with that. As I mentioned, it was done in the silhouette of a teapot, but it's really a sake wine pot and it's composed of two separate parts this is the part where see it's finished in cloisonne up here I've taken and the sake pot out and this is the lid which sits sits in place it sits in place, it does not screw in place, it sits in place, completely finished on the inside and closet A. The cylindrical part was the part that held the sake. Very, very petite, very petite. And they put the sake in there and this would be filled with hot water. And this was... Sake teapot. To make sure that absolutely all the closet is in place. Oh, it's, this has got wonderful detailing. It's so Victorian in design. It's in really good shape. I don't see anything missing. It's all brass. It feels really heavy. The bottom's also finished. And you know, what's even more amazing is even though the, the bottom is completely flush and totally finished, it didn't see any movement because there's no scratching or uh, chipping away of the cloisonnier on the bottom. This is a beautiful piece. It sounds beautiful. Uh, four and a half inches tall. Sexagon uh, geometric shape that's three and a half inches square. Hexagon. Thank you.